Hello YouTube, LSP99 here and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a solar filter for your camera lens. Now in a few days time there's going to be an eclipse visible from Europe, parts of um, Asia, North America and North Africa. So uh, hopefully if the weather's good I'm going to try and get some photos of it from where I am. Um, as you can see here my solar filter I've made fits snugly inside a lens hood. Now if your camera doesn't have a lens hood then you need to either find one on the internet and buy one for a few pounds or you need to try and find a different technique because this solar filter is specifically made for a lens hood so um, to make your solar filter you're going to need a lens hood some solar film, cardboard, some scissors or a cutting knife, a ruler, double sided tape and a pair of compasses optional you may want to use some coloured cellophane, black felt tip pen and some sandpaper Okay, so the first thing we need to do is we need to measure our inside diameter of our lens hood. Now make sure you're measuring the inside and not the outside because our filter we're making is actually going to fit inside the lens hood and not the outside. So um, we need to make sure it's a nice snug fit and it doesn't fall out while you're taking photos. So uh, what you need to do is you need to measure that. Um, mine is 8.2 um, centimetres in diameter. So my power compass is going to be set to 4.1 and that will give me the radius and when I draw it that will give me my full diameter so on your cardboard you need to draw two circles of the diameter which you measured like this okay and then you need to make a second diameter uh, on the inside of that circle to make um, a hole so you can put the filter in and allow light to pass through into the lens now either side of this uh, inner diameter you want to have uh, between 1.5 and 2 centimeters worth of cardboard um, between that diameter and the outside edge. So uh, I'm going to have 1.5 centimeters on either side. So uh, I've set my radius of my other compass um, to 2.6, and that will give me a diameter which is uh, 5.2. So just again do that. Okay, and then I'm just going to quickly go ahead and cut out these uh, two inner circles and the uh, outer rings as well and I'll uh, continue with this tutorial okay so as you can see now I've cut out my two cardboard rings and on one face on each I've covered it in double sided tape now on the reverse um, of the outside ring I have coloured it black just to make the finished solar filter look a bit nicer if you do this make sure you're doing it before you put the solar filter in because if your pen slips and draws on the solar filter then your work's going to be completely ruined so this is the solar filter we're going to be using it's Bader solar film uh, this sheet in particular came in a size that's just smaller than A4 and cost me around the £20 mark um, so make sure you read the instructions um, and I must stress when you're putting the solar filter between your two rings don't stretch it because it doesn't need to be stretched it can be quite wrinkly and it will still work absolutely fine so this is the pre-cut square I did earlier on um, and that's going to fit perfectly inside my ring so all that's left for me now to do is uh, with my sticky side just place that down onto the solar filter like that okay and then I'll turn that over and with the other side with these uh, double side you need to make sure you can align it as much as you, you can the best you can like that and once you've put it down you can't take your rings back off because that's going to completely ruin the filter and then all that's left for me to do now is just to trim the outside and I'll show you um, the finished filter okay so as you can see here I've now cut off any excess from the solar filter um, there are still a few bits around the side which I can't cut off but uh, that's fine as long as it still fits in the lens hood um, it's also a good idea to make yourself or find what a, a box which you can put your filter in just so when you're not using it um, there's no chance the solar film is going to be ripped um, also this is an option you can do but uh, I've made a cellophane coloured filter so when the light's coming in through this filter once it's been filtered it's also going to go through some some color which will add a yellow color to the sun in this case and that's optional um, I've only done that out of one ring of cardboard because it's not as important as this 
But uh, I'm going to now demonstrate how it fits into the lens. So that will go in first. That goes in quite far. And then the solar filter, you need to make sure that does stay nice and tight into the hood. And as you can see, that's not going to fall out. So to remove the filter, you just take your lens hood off. And then from the back with your two thumbs, just push on the ring outwards and it will come out like that. And just make sure you're not going to touch the solar filter when you do this. So uh, thanks for watching guys. Hope you find the uh, video helpful. Uh, make sure you don't look at the sun without any proper protection or with a solar filter that is broken. So uh, thanks for watching guys. Hope you like the video and I'll see you next time. Bye.